Sierra Leone's Diamond Industry, Mavis, Megala, Ivan. Sierra Leone, Capital, Freetown, Currency, Sierra Leonean Luan, President, Ernest Bicaroma, Official Language, English Language, Government, Unitary State, Presidential System, Constitutional Republic, Total Area, 71,740 km to 27,699 square miles. Population, 6,002,011 United Nations Estimate. History of Diamond Mining Diamonds were found in the early 1930s, with the Sierra Leone Selection Trust SLST, holding the monopoly for mining from 1934 to 1956. In 1955, the SLST gave up rights to alluvial deposits outside its lease, which allowed small-scale mining of alluvial deposits. By 1965, there had been a large movement from agricultural work to working these deposits. Economy of Sierra Leone Mineral exports, especially diamonds remain the main currency in there for its economic base. Sierra Leone also has the world's largest deposit of rutile, a titanium ore used as paint pigments and welding rod coatings. Other mineral ores which serves as a major boost to the economy include bauxite and iron ore, the biggest iron ore deposit in Africa and the third largest in the world. Diamonds Sierra Leone relies on mining, especially diamonds for its economic base. The country is among the top 10 diamond producing nations with an annual production range between US dollar 250 million to 300 million dollars. Sierra Leone is a major producer of gem quality diamonds and mineral exports remain the main currency earner for the country. Despite being among the top 10 diamond producing nations, the mining sector faces many challenges, including weak laws and smuggling issues. Blood diamonds also called a conflict diamond, converted diamond, hot diamond, or war diamond. A blood diamond is a diamond mined in a war zone and sold to finance an insurgency. In Sierra Leone's case it was a civil war that involved child soldiers. De Beers Group is an internationally based diamond mining and trading company that has controlled the flow of diamonds in the U.S. marketplace for decades. De Beers has been accused of human rights violations dealing in conflict diamonds, and price fixing, among others. Blood Diamonds The Clean Diamonds Act The Kimberley Process Rebuilding Sierra Leone The revenue from its diamonds exports are helping to rebuild Sierra Leone after the Civil War. That lasted from 1991 to 2002. The money that was once used to fund this civil war is now partial being used to improve health services and education in Sierra Leone. Although corruption in Sierra Leone still exists the country is getting better. For instance, some $125 million worth of diamonds were illegally exported from Sierra Leone in 2006, compared to almost none at the end of the 1990s. The End